You're watching Lynn TV and Lucy Robson with today's main stories from Paphos. Police are continuing their search for arsonists responsible for an attack on the Oskepasti church early Wednesday morning. Unidentified people broke into the church and when they failed to empty a collection box, started a fire which damaged two icons. One, displaying an image of the Virgin Mary, was a replica. The original is housed in the Paphos Byzantine Museum. Police say they have no leads on the arsonists. A delegation from Paphos Municipality has returned from Hanya in Greece where they attended a town twinning ceremony. Paphos and Hanya are now set to participate jointly in several European programs, details of which the municipality will announce in coming days. The second part of the twinning ceremony will take place in Paphos next summer when a delegation will visit from Hanya. According to the National Statistics Office, in November the number of unemployed rose to 20,892, recording an on-the-month increase of 1.6%. On the year, unemployment rose 73% in November. And local police news. Police seized 2,700 DVDs in a raid on shops and kiosks across Paphos last night. Well, thanks for joining us. We'll be back tomorrow with more local news.